Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Montgomery, Alabama, with the gruesome twosome frauditing pair known as McRusty and Wife. And of course, they're here to, well, be the royal pain in the ass of everybody in the area and lie, fraud it, and act like a pair of complete morons until they get trespassed from the area. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. DT and the J-Town Press went hot in the Montgomery, Alabama Regional Airport. Please make sure to like, share, subscribe to include smashing that notification bell. How about no? Well, the majority of this video is just him going through his usual circular reasoning, only this time he's in the middle of a freaking busy airport with a lot of loud music, and uh, it's... Well, hard to hear sometimes, so let's just go ahead and skip on ahead to the part where they get trespassed out of the airport because we all know how Georgia transparency can be. Obvious lies, circular reasoning, and every other frauditor uh, piece of logic that they have. Fifteen minutes later. Uh, I'm just trying to figure out what's going on. Right, what? I don't know, the, some lady came down and just said, you're not allowed to exercise free press, you have to leave. Who said that? Just some, I don't know, I got, I, she told me her name. I, I or whatever. Well, luckily, this part is one of the few instances of where you can actually hear somebody talk, and it, it's kind of showing that, well, you're a damn liar once again, Rusty Boy. So, here you go, watch this. Okay. Come on now, Rusty Boy. Why must you make your uh, lies so damn easy to debunk and just tear down? I mean, if you wanted to make it look that way, why did you leave that part in the video? I, I got what you're going on. So y'all just filming for right now? Certain areas, because I know there were some areas where she was at TSA, the other person that you're here with, can't film in those areas. Oh, we can't she, film TSA? Not, not the machine area. And oh. the machine out front, too. Oh. What? But it's from public. Oh, yeah. Uh, the Rusty Boy, weren't you in the military? I mean, didn't you get trained in uh, security and all that, if I'm not mistaken? Well, intelligence at the very least. So you should be very much aware that there are specific areas that are considered secured and therefore they don't need morons like you trying to divulge every little secret that they may have to their security procedures. You Because you know what they say, loose lips sink ships and I'm sure during certain periods of time, your loose lips would have sunk a lot of ships. You can't go up those stairs, man. She went up the stairs. So she, she, oh, she but there's nothing that says okay. you can't go up there. That's, that's, that's fine. fine. That's fine. Let me, let me say this. Are y'all going to buy a ticket? Are you going to fly? Or are y'all just walking around? I just prefer not to answer any questions. That's fine, then. Well, y'all going to have to leave. You're not going to perform in any duties. Oh, I am. Okay, that's fine. I am. Not. How you doing? Good. Can, can I get fine. names and badge numbers, please? Let me, let me finish talking. How you think, okay. Jennings? Jenkins, I'm so sorry, sir. Go ahead. I'm so sorry. If you're not going to buy a ticket, if you're not going to do business with the rental car company, you know if you're not going to do business with the rental car company, Chief of police, or if you're not going to have engage any type of business with the airport, you're going to have to leave. Okay. So oh. freedom of press is not business. We didn't say that. We said if you're not going to okay. conduct any business, yeah, we are freedom of press. Okay. Lana, uh, freedom of the press doesn't exactly mean what you think it means. It means that you have the right to publish your story. It does not mean that you have the right to do whatever the hell you please around there. There's still the public forum doctrines with for good reason, dumbass. In addition, their communications director earlier pretty much told you how it was, but she didn't say anything about it being completely restricted. You need to learn to listen, uh, Lana. Learn to listen and maybe you'll make it farther in life. But that's, that's not, you gotta be engaged in business activity. Yeah, it's called freedom of press under the U.S. Constitution. No, yeah, you can record, case law. but you, you can record, but I'm telling you, you're gonna have to leave right now if you're not gonna be doing the type of business. You know? Oh, I just go buy a soda then. Yeah. I'm thirsty, I just go buy a soda. Yeah, when you finish with your soda then. Oh, when I finish with my soda, I have to leave? Oh, there's a time limit. Yeah, it's wide open. Yeah, time, place, manner, right? Have y'all ever heard of uh, 
the U.S. Constitution by chance? Oh, come on now, Rusty boy. Everybody in the United States is taught about the U.S. Constitution in elementary school. Don't give us that Billy Jack bullshit. So, did y'all ever heard of that? Yeah, activity, okay? Like I just told you, explain to the, the places where you can record it, okay? If you're not going to engage in any type of business right, activity with places, the airport. Right. Oh, yeah, public places, yeah. You're not going to engage in any type of activity. Oh, that's her right here. And she said not, that there's no freedom of the press a lot here. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't say that. So, please don't put me on report because I did not oh, but, say that. We got it written. Go ahead, Brittany. You got to lie to fraud it and, uh, well... Georgia Transparency, you tend to prove that in every one of your videos. I mean, you twist the words of everybody around you, but you leave those uh, original words left in the video for others to, well, debunk what you say and point out how much of a moron you are for leaving the evidence for all to see that you are a liar. A little longer than a few minutes later. Where's your vehicle at, sir? When our founding fathers said a tyranny, that was you. When you were a tyranny. Founding oh, do we have to leave the property? Yes, or we just can't go back oh, in the no, building? Leave the property. That's what I explained to you. Can you, can you give us a written trespass warning? Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, these are tyrants. This is what's the, uh, what's the, what's the, um, I just explained that to you earlier. No, what, no, I, I just want to make sure we're clear on the same sheet. We what's the are, reasoning actually, that we're being... Don't make a footage up on your camera. You all are going to have to leave right now. What's the reason we're being removed? Okay, I just told you loitering. Okay, okay have a great day. Thank you. All right. Thank you. This, this is the tyranny that our founding fathers, this is what they, this is the, America keeps that asking, what does tyranny look like? Like, this is what it looks like right here. This is what it looks like. Yeah, if you have no business on that property, then you're essentially loitering, dude. Not to mention it's a limited public forum, which means they do have control over everything that goes on in that building. They do have a uh, administrator that can, uh, well, take you through the process of being able to film in there. But you just wanted to ignore that. How convenient for your little narrative right there. You just wanted to ignore the fact that they tried to help you out. But nope, you just want to make, make it look like that they were the bad guys. Oh boy, GT. When will you ever learn that you shouldn't film any of this stuff and leave it in your video? Otherwise, people will make sure that it is well known that you are definitely a fraud. So at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?